Okay, welcome back to Diablo 3. This is Rift Challenge 308 on the Europe server. Um, I've tried it one time already, got 6 minutes 35 seconds. So I'm going to start up. Didn't, didn't make it. So, looking into the mirror, you've got a couple of, well, three sets. You've got this set. Uh, Judgment has no cooldown, gains effect of every ruin. Attacks from Phoenix Arbiters, reduce the cooldown. And apply condemn when attacking enemies. Your damage is increased and you take less damage. In this, your melee damage is reduced. Thousand, thousand decks. You gain additional 100% of your strength. And then you have regenerate life, reduce all resource cost. All of this good stuff. Then here, enemies kill wall. You're the champion, turns into Phalanx avatars for 10 seconds. And you've got gems leveled up. You know, every, everything filled out here. And, let's see, don't get hit too much because then you can't move. And you include everything. Then this is really good for, plus a hammer, which it doesn't have. So, and the Templar, uh, it's got some stuff on, but it can die easily. You got a 1,032 Paragon levels. And you also, the person did the altar. So jump in, hit your potion, so you got something to go with. So, pretty much I have to go through here. I, of course, on my first run, made the wrong move. Can you believe that? I believe that. Um, Asia server was actually an easy piece of cake walk through for me. Um, I didn't have my voice for the whole weekend, so that's why I didn't do any Diablo 4 content. I did play it. I did, um, I got maybe three hours in. It was a tough three hours. But I got to 20 and two attempts to beat the world boss. I was able to do that. So, last time I went straight across. This time I'm going to go down. And you're going to see why I go down. Because you have this power pylon. Now, one of your gems, you get extra damage from wherever you defeat a elite group and all so it will help you out so you don't come up this way and then lose track of all the goodies because you got another group right down here it didn't have much on the top end um this one's not really as fun as last week's last week's i enjoyed so much the chicken was great. And go ahead and kill this guy. I don't have the major damage going. But you can take a lot of damage. So that that is very helpful for this. Being able to take damage does balance out. But not being able to kill real fast. It's kind of bothersome. So. And I forget to hit the potion every now and then. Because you got it, you use it. Especially whenever you get the damage one. Just got to tear everything up while you you got it. So now I'm up by a minute. Because I did not make the mistakes I made earlier. And got that gem there. Which makes this great. I did find these guys hiding in the corner the first time. So bring up your little, little group with you. It makes killing things a lot easier. And boom. Mostly I'm bringing them up because it helps my recharge. Oh, see, I keep forgetting to hit the potion. Then go on through here. Run on down. See, my first attempt, I was like, man, there's a whole lot of trash in this. Because I just was not finding the champions. I was like, this is just retardedly difficult. But, after one run, you get to see where the champions are hiding. The big people that you need to kill. So you can go through and kill them. 
And you gotta kill all of them. And you also get that bonus. Yeah. Shouldn't have hit the potion there, but I did. Get these guys out of the way. Go ahead and get these guys mad. I'm, I'm a lot further along than I was last time. Got these guys to come up to meet me. Because I really don't need to go down there. You're pretty much just keeping everything up. Just hitting all your buttons. And of course you get this at the bottom of the stairs. But okay, I used that up. Time for me to go find other people to destroy and smash. There we go. So as long as it brings up those little, little helpers, it helps me recharge faster for the champion. And this one I might time better. So I will have hopefully 95% before I kill him. Oh, as you see, I'm not getting hurt. Easily just swinging away. Hitting all your little buttons. Move over. Shopping on him. There we go. Big guy's up. I about have another potion to go. And I can chop away on him. Where's he going? Over here. Hit the potion. And done. The potion helps out a whole lot. 5 minutes, 13 seconds. Um, I, I've not played this character, especially this setup. These dynamics. Before. So, but I'm in the top 3. The 4 minute run is most likely possible but like my first run i didn't get the time needed as you saw this was the slowest one out of the three this week uh, get your shield on your killing is in your champion mode like you don't do any damage at all so you go into champion that's your left click that's your right click you don't have any good instant kills so you're building up your little men, your army, to be able to kill. As you build up your army, your cooldown, you get judgment. See, it's a it's a different type of setup for me. Because he has, me not having the champion, it's not going to go fast. So there's a the champion. I get the little phallic reserve. I keep hitting them and holding down my right click. And just by killing one, you're not going to get your recharge. So this one, you do have to kill a lot of trash to be able to keep your recharge going. And it's, it's a little different build. From Europe, this was a harder one for the week. Um, if you need help, just let me know. Um, I'm going to be off and on. I'm still trying to get better. Um, didn't have a voice for three days. Finally went, got a steroid shot, steroid pack, and some strong antibiotics. So hopefully I'll be able to narrate better next time. Hopefully you were able to do the server slam. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Um, it gave a good taste of what it is to be level 20 and go against a world boss and also just how fast you can get in over your head um, you know a little bit over two weeks we'll hopefully have you on Diablo 4 I'll still be doing Diablo 3 content and if you have any questions just let me know please be kind to others